Today is Friday, March 17. I am Jose Say Torres, your Blaze Bulletin. Come see Shrek the Musical this weekend at the Bagman High School Auditorium. Performances are March 16, 17, and 18 at 7 p.m. and March 19 at 2 p.m. Tickets are $5 for students and $10 for, for adults. Anyone interested in running for student council class officers or student body officers for next school year needs to pick up an election packet outside or Mr. Breed's room G01. Packets are due by March 24th. Becker's Closet is a foundation that provides free prom dresses to anyone that needs one. We will be holding a prom dress trial on day Saturday, March 18th from 10 to 1. Please see Mr. Rose D4 for further questions. And by the way, guys, there's going to, there's going to be one week left to spring break. And now we're going to have a weather section with the random self, Chris Barnett. Thank you, Jose. Hello, Blaze. My name is Christopher Barnett. I'm here to tell you guys the weather for Friday. It's going to be a nice, chilly, but kind of warm, 58 degrees, but it will be raining, which I'm pretty sure is going to bring the temperature a little bit down, and it's going to be cloudy, so not really much sun. Um, the sun is going to rise at 6.53 a.m., and the sun is going to set at 6.54 p.m. Now... My advice for you guys is to wear a jacket and to bring an umbrella because you're going to need it. Thank you. Go Blaze. Back to you, Jose. Thank you, Chris. I am Jose Say Torn, just your Blaze Boots. And be sure to check us out on our YouTube channels with the Minute Cast Boots. Go Blaze. Go Blaze. Dyslexia is the way our brain processes a language. You hear things from our ears and our eyes to our brain, and sometimes our brain doesn't pick up what we need. I just remember in the third grade is when it all came about, and I remember the teacher writing things on the board, and we were supposed to copy it down, and then I would get it back with a grade, and I had written my words backwards. At some point, I went to the eye doctor. They thought it was vision problem. And I went to the eye doctor, and the eye doctor told my parents I could see great, and everybody was happy, and except for me, I still couldn't read. So I got over it, I learned to adapt. If I was gonna tell a child with dyslexia or their parents anything, it would be, don't give up. We all have our differences and we can push through them, we can adapt to them. You can do anything you wanna do and just because you have dyslexia, it doesn't have to hold you back. What's up guys, my name is Jose Toro and I am here with the cast members of the Shrek musical and their names are? I'm Jarrett Royer and I'm playing Shrek. I'm Luke Gentry and I am double casted as Lord Farquaad and Donkey. And I'm, and I'm just gonna be asking you some questions about the musical in general, so let's just get right into it. What made you get into this musical in the first place? Well, um, let's see, we started it all the way back in freshman year, yeah. right? Yeah. And then we all got sent home because of COVID, like the week before the show was about to happen. Um, and so now it was like, it was weird how we were gonna do it our freshman year. And a lot of the stuff is like kind of the same, like, yeah, certain yeah. like dances are the same. Yeah. yeah. It's just, and you wouldn't think that like with the characters that we got then, we'd be here now. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so. What was the hardest part about just like playing as character in general, like, you know? I'm gonna let you take that one first. Um, since I'm double casted as Farquaad and Donkey, um, I have to do like a lot of more work than a lot of other people. But for Farquaad, it's to be on my knees the entire time. It's great. Uh, I'll get some knee pads, but they don't, they don't work. Uh, <laughs> There was one scene where I had to run off stage like as fast as I could on my knees. I ran that scene seven times and I went home and my knees were purple, Dude, like all over. It was, it was great. What about you? Um, for me, I'd have to say it's probably the shoes I have to wear because they are like four inch platforms so I can be as tall as that guy. Because we, but, and like, we have to run in a Ooh. scene and it's like sharp turns. I've rolled my ankle so many times. How many takes like did you get to get that one shot? We've ran so many times. I have lost count. Oh, <laughs> All right. So, what was the funnest uh, just experience about this whole like musical? At the risk of sounding corny, it's kind of the people. 
in the cast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, I mean, with 50 people, it's hard to get that kind of connection. But, but meeting like all the new people and yeah, yeah, and like kind of passing on the mantle to them yeah. is pretty. It's gonna be rough. Not our last show. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be rough. Mm -hmm. But you know. So when is the show? Let's see. What's it say here? <laughs> well. March 16th through the 18th uh, at 7 p.m. Then March 19th at 2 p.m. That's this Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Yeah. Uh, tickets are five five dollars for students and ten dollars for adults. Mm -hmm. And where's the show gonna be at? Right here in our very own Blackman Auditorium. Yeah, you can walk out that door right there and just go see it. Yeah, just go. You should. Be yeah, just yeah, right now. We're not go. go. Sweet leaf. I think it's because like, I don't know. You, you, you can go. You can go. No, I don't think you can. No, you can go. Well, I think it's because you can go. We can finish it. We can well, <laughs> That was it for the end of the guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, make sure you guys come to the auditorium so you can see like these two guys perform. Uh, they're all characters. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. That was it.